Welcome back to Let's Play Croaktel. We're heading up to floor three as we clear out these dastardly creatures. Didn't I say that at the end of the previous video? Hey. From our workplace. Hey. At least I assume it's our workplace. I don't know. Hey. Hey. Maybe we work from home. You know, it's nice to know that that crow hotel isn't the only place with uh, bottomless pits, though. Let me in. Take that. Hip. Yeah. How do you get to this room other than through this vent? Who designed hey. this place? Hip. Hip. Yeah, I saw you there. Gotcha. Hip. Okay, should this should Hip. be the last room, the only Hip. room that I have hey. not been in. So come, final creature. Hip. Yeah, I see you over there. Gotcha. Hip. Hey. Yeah, I guess Hip. that's it. We's good. Hey. 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 Hip. That should be the last of them. We've defeated the invading forces. Hey. And we can go free our cat bosses. Why do I work for you two? But honest to goodness, who cares? It's, uh, it's work. Not everyone can be super excited about their work. There's always gonna be something going on. be a boss you don't get along with entirely. The point isn't to find work that you love, because it's gonna be nearly impossible. I mean, if you do find it, more power to you, but as long as you can find something you can stand, it gets it done. Yeah, we got this. I'll take your finest worst room. I'll need it. So this is our final challenge. As the music would as the music would expect. Okay, with the boxes in the way, we have to go in this first door. And this is not our room. We just have to get to our own. Gonna be some interesting platforming on our way. And this is gonna be kind of interesting. Whoops! So I wanna wait just a little bit. Nope. The problem here... I need to, like, enter that second one at a slightly lower angle. Okay, let's try this again. Yeah! Eat it! Don't care, made it. Oh yeah, hold left, um, otherwise you're gonna get hit. This is the part of the game that just will kill you, 
So, cool beans. Crap. Hip. 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 Hope. Nope, made this far. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. I'm not entirely sure what I did there. Hit. Ah! I don't recall jumps quite this precise anywhere else after this. So once we get through this, ah, uh, we'll be good. Okay, no, we're going to the right. Yeah, we made it. So this whole area, this whole final area, is kind of a... A mad dash of everything that we ran into in Crowtel. With the difficulty amped up, all the mechanics, everything's here. I don't even know what you are. I did it, I made it. Whoop. 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 A lot of the jumps getting up here are... I guess they are. I guess you could say there's very little tell, very little a hint as to where you need to go, but it always follows a pretty set pattern of, hey, if there's something new, get on it, and then get back. Hey, if there's something new, get on it, and then get back. Hey, we went to the left, maybe we should go right, and then back to the center. I would have guessed going to the left after that, but it finished. It's a lot of ice. It's a lot of ice and it's moving. We got a book! We got a book! We gotta outrun this! Or else we're just gonna be a frozen frog sickle. No! It's not super difficult to stay ahead of the ice, but if you make a stupid mistake and, like, fall off the edge, then that is gonna be it for you. I'm just gonna get hit by that one. It's too low, so I can't run under it without getting hit. That one I can run under. Oh, we did it! I like that checking, uh, hitting the checkpoints refills your health, so you don't even have to worry about that. Okay, this guy is, this guy is gonna be trouble. Ah! So you gotta jump once to bait him, because despite what one would expect, you cannot stand on the carpet duck, and duck, you will still get hit. So another guy here, just gotta bait him too. And then jump to the best of your ability. Yeah, see, you just get hit. So there's a lot of those little goo guys that are just in a really bad spot around here. Like this guy, you can jump over him the first time real easily, but if you jump over him the second time, either the platform is going to be moving back and you're going to miss the platform, or you're going to be too far away to make the jump over here or something. Like that second jump is timed really awkwardly. And then similarly, in terms of very awkward jumps... Well, that's why they gave me a checkpoint. So I don't have to do any of that again. You come down, I get on you. Those guys, I can't figure out how to jump over them or duck under them or whatever and not get hit, so I just eat two hits. 
And then we just have to get to the next checkpoint without dying, which is right here. So it's honestly not that hard. Just eat the damage, you're good to go. Hey. And more boxes. Hip. Hey, after a day like this, a room's a room. It looks room enough. Ah. Ah. But this is our room. You should go talk to the hotel manager, because I'm pretty sure she's got some... She'd like to know that you're here in this room. Boss, 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 boss. Not actually that hard a boss, all things considered. Hey. Hip. Hip. Okay, so those I intentionally tried to bait as far over as possible because it's really hard to do this part. When you've got to worry about those jumping over and around those fires. Should've jumped. Didn't. Should've. Ah! Oh no, a bubble! What do I do now? Other than keep hitting you and hopefully something happens. I can hit you now. Hey. Hit. Hey. Ah. You and your stupid bubble. Hit. Hey, another one. Hey. Hey. Hit. Hit. Hey. It's okay, we got this. We got this. Just a little more. We did it. Get out of my hotel room. Hey, wait. Hey, wait, you're a ghost. You can't do that. Come back with my bed. Come back with my bed, you monster. Yeah, you know what? I'm done. I am done for the day. After this... You know, sometimes the floor can be reasonably comfortable. It all depends how tired you are. But this has been Croaktel. And now we get the story of how our small amphibian friend made it into that pit. But then that means that Crotel took place months after this. Because you remember, Lily said, like, I've been down here for months, or whatever. So what about the health inspector cats? Did they not even bother looking into trying to figure out what the crap happened to Lily for that long? Did they just stop caring? These guys are jerks. Until next time, everyone, this has been Let's Play Crotel. I hope you enjoyed playing. Next, I think we may get back to It'll Do 2. Until then, everyone.